I'm Louise Rowe here at the BAFTA Nespresso Nominees Party 2017 for a red carpet interview with a difference. I'll be putting aspiring filmmakers' questions forward to some of the brightest and the best in film. Any advice for people aspiring to do what you do? I think if you love it, you'll find a way to make it work um, and you'll find a way to make a living from it. And the other half of it is just honestly work harder than you could possibly think to work. I think the advice that, that we would give is kind of persistence and um, you know, everyone in the world and their brother told us not to make a kind of film in Farsi language and um, I guess it's if you believe in the content and the filmmaker, you know, go for it. I would say never give up. It's very, very hard. You'll get a 10 reasons a day to quit, but just keep pushing forward. If you're a writer, you have to keep writing, write for free, let anyone read it that wants to read it, and keep going for it. How do you go about getting a project like La La Land greenlit? So with Whiplash we did a short film to kind of help get, you know, get the money, but that was a smaller project. This, you know, La La Land, we needed real resources to do it, um, so it took time. But, you know, I had some passionate producers on my side, and of course, obviously, you know, getting uh, Emma and Ryan to do the film, I mean, all of that really helped make it a movie uh, that the studio could get behind making. Give us a little of a, how you begin. Unfortunately, the, the beginning is, is the part that is least easy to give advice about because it, in the beginning you have an idea. And then from there I, I always have to have a character and some kind of idea for what the story is going to be and then I build out from there. I think the most important thing is to just learn to love story. But understanding why those two things go together, that's what makes story, is when emotion and ideas come together in some way that engages you, that draws you in as an audience. Any advice to anyone who's watching you right now thinking, oh my God, she's doing it. How do they get there? If you love it and if it's your life and it's your passion, you have to follow it. And it has to be the only thing that you care about. And it is the only thing that I care about. So, yeah. Absolutely everything to that one thing. Yeah, just believe in your life. It's the love of my life.